was going to say, why do people lie? Yeah, you lock off the whole thing. Now, let me tell you why I didn't think that was correct. <laughs> That's if you deep it. Too. <laughs> oh, Delph I don't know what they mean. <laughs> I might even be a cabin just for a day. I'll go to Africa. Not to understand, because he wants to be on the dumb side. First of all, we're not going to do that. Second Hey guys, welcome to episode 35 of the Let Me Land podcast. It's your host, the, the most is the reshape T. And why are you doing oh that? <laughs> guys. Anyway, guys, so today I have got for you Abana, Toby, Prince G. We know the fucking vibe. We got a new guest in the building. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, how's everyone doing? Everyone good? Everyone ready for the episode? Yeah. Yeah, wonderful, ready wonderful. for the vibe? <laughs> First question, would you date someone with their ex's name tattooed on them? You're crazy. <laughs> Never that. Never that. Why? Cause I just like it I feel like it's a it's a form of craziness. It's like why are you doing that? Oh, okay. Because for me anyway, let me just say that mm -hmm. just now for this, I would never get my girls or my wife uh, mm -hmm. name tattooed on me. Mm -hmm. You've been married for like ten years. I would never do it only because yeah, it's, like, it's it's not because I don't believe it's gonna be forever. Yeah. It's just like, why am I doing that? Like, you could actually still be a temporary person. I'm so sorry. I'm and the thing is that yeah, all you can actually promise in life, yeah, to your partner is that you won't switch up. Mm. As much as you believe your partner's loyal and everything like that, you cannot like bet your life that they're never going to switch up because you can't control them. Yeah. No you get it. So that's why I'm never doing it. So if they've done it in the past, I'm just going to think you don't think about decisions like 100%. Mm -hmm. So yeah, never that. I can't like, The reason I never be someone like that is because when you got that tattoo, yeah. it was like... You're getting it because you want that person to be a part of you for life. You get what I mean? <laughs> for life. <laughs> for life. Yeah. So, if that person's a part of you for life, don't even look at me. <laughs> don't even look at me. Come me, I don't know you. <laughs> I can see that man walking on the road. I don't even know you. <laughs> nah. Wait, I have another question after, but I don't know. Would you do it? Would you get out of someone with that name? Yeah, if they cover it up. With what? Another tattoo. So, if you saw it, yeah, it wouldn't put you off. Mm. For you to say if they covered it up, that means if you, if it was somewhere that you could not see, like here, obviously you know it's there, but like you no, never see it. No, it's even another tattoo. Oh, that's, they have to get like a tattoo. Yeah. Over. Even if you can't really see it like that. Let's say it's at the bottom of their foot. You know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they need to get it covered up. Okay, but if then. they would, then yeah. Okay, then follow up question. What would you do if you found the person had the name person's name tattooed on them? Mm. They told you it was a dead relative. Oh. Later turns out it's actually their ex. I'm just saying, why do people lie? <laughs> yeah, lock off the whole thing. Because if you're lying so from the jump, like, what do you want? So wait, okay, wait, wait. How long after did they let you know? You find, like, out, you find out like two years deep in the relationship. Uh, why'd they tell me? <laughs> yeah, that's so true. No, you just found out by accident. You found out by accident. Oh, shit. Don't even ask me that. I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh, you got, oh me, I know. <laughs> like, oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. I thought we were just laughing. <laughs> me, I'm definitely finished. <laughs> now, you're right, though. You're right. They're nice to the joke. I'm just cheating on me. I found that. No, like, yeah, especially that. Uh, <laughs> <like, laughs> especially if right, you right. find out. Especially if they didn't even confess. If they mm -hmm. confessed it, one, I would be like, why are you even telling me anything? Like, like, yeah, true. It. But, like, if I'm the one who found out, I'm now going to think there's bare shit you've lied to me. Yeah, what did you thought? Oh yeah, it was just a, it was just a serious date. Like I, just... I, I might forgive that then maybe. No. What? Only because like they didn't want to hurt your feelings. That's why they didn't. Oh, like they were thinking about your feelings. And yeah. They you're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> but they were. Oh, no. Oh, wait, okay, cool. Do, do you know what you said? Um, if they cover it up, it'll be cool. Yeah. Let's see. You know how like now our uni students and shit. Yeah. Uh -huh. So like, obviously not everybody's financially the best to get it. Let's say now, yeah. The money they're making, they've got other priorities rather than getting another tattoo to cover that up. Mm -hmm. Are you going to save them for, like, let's say, like, a year until they can actually get that money to cover up? Like, Every you time you see that person's yeah, like, name, you that's it? brave. Because not everyone's lie. got the money right now to just yeah, get a tattoo to cover up. Yeah, they cover it up. Like, <laughs> like, that'd be realistic, though. cover it up, were you guys talking about, like, pay to remove it or, like, just get like, yeah, a tattoo or something? Yeah, get a tattoo for it, it. Not everyone has the money to do that. Like, right now you get it. I've got other priorities and shit. That is a good question. You get it. Because right now it's like you wanted to do that, but like, they legit got other shit going why on. did he get a tattoo of someone's name when you're this young? That's so bad. <laughs> nah, true, true. That, yeah, that's true as well. But what's the, like, 20 age? I can't lie. You're talking about priorities. That's that's a make or break situation for the whole relationship. Oh! So oh, realistically, okay. so realistically if your relationship isn't a priority and you don't get that done now, then cool, you can come back to me one year when you've removed it. 
But until then, <laughs> alright, cool. Let me say this then, yeah. Mm. Cause if it's a case of now you're like used to us speaking in it, yeah, mm. and like you're obviously you're fucking with this guy and everything, but he's got his ex's name tatted on him. You mm-hmm. get it? He's not gonna be thinking my priority. Is this girl who I'm only speaking to, to mm. get this covered up. You get it? Like he's gonna wanna wait for it. Like not gonna lie, that shouldn't even be a priority for you. Well, like you're not going out, you're speaking. Yeah. But realistically, even if you're speaking, let's say he was even still chatting to his ex, it's still not gonna be a priority because you're not together. Do you get what I mean? Mm. So he would never even have to take the like text out off anyway. Crazy. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> so um, I think what we learned from this is that uh, just don't idea. tattoo people's names on your body. It's a bit long. No. So it's only my my mad, my father, my kids. I'm doing. Yeah, because I can't. Like, Nobody that's else. another thing. These people aren't even fucking related to you, bro. We have no blood relation I at know. all. I don't know you from anywhere. I'm so sorry. That's why I don't understand. You know what? And, well, do you not believe in um, the whole, you know, when you have sex, like the whole sexual bonds type of thing? Soul ties. Yeah, soul ties. Because if you believe in that, do you also believe in if you tattoo someone's name on you? That you're, you're now bonded for life alive. I mean, me personally, I would not do it anyway because, yeah. God forbid, yeah, it's that long. And yeah, no, I do believe in soul ties. I can't like, yeah, man, like, they're both bullshit, man. Okay, see, I don't believe in it either, but I'm saying if you do believe in it, then you should also believe that if you get a name tattooed on you, it's now bonded for life. Should believe never, in it? I'll never get a name tattooed on me. Do you well. believe in soul ties? Yeah. So if you not believe in soul ties, do you also believe if they got a name and they're tattooed on them? It's the same thing? No. Why is it the same thing? Because that's ink. Yeah, but basically permanent, though. Like, yeah, but it's just ink. It's well, that's even like... more reflective. Than <laughs> no, but your soul yeah. is you. Ink is just ink. Like, like, okay, but what? ink is like, okay, this is actually on me. Like, I've got it now injected into me, fam. Like, <laughs> injected. Yeah, you can, you can <laughs> like, huh? You can be. You can take it off. That don't even make sense, though. Well, because can, if you know, can you hear what you're saying? Can you hear what you're saying? Because if you know beating somebody, you know leave the yard. No, that's your game. I, listen, I'm gonna walk out <laughs> okay, because this always happens. I know for a fact what I'm saying makes sense, yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 These things are gonna try to Ink, yeah. Yeah. Like you can like you can cut that piece of skin and that ink has gone out of your body, like it's not on you on you anymore. Mm. But, the thing but is, your soul is like is in you. Yeah. Okay. But then what the thing is like ink is very permanent. Like regardless, yeah, as much as you take out, there's always gonna be a part of it that's on you. It seeps into your skin, bro. I understand what you're saying. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's because he's choosing not to understand because he wants to be on the dumb side. First of all, we're not gonna do that. Second of all, <laughs> you wanna talk about? I'm telling you, about she's you wanna talk about permanent? Like you wanna talk about uh, long day? Sometimes it's gonna be a very long day. You're permanently putting ink into your skin. I can't lie, if you're cheating someone, you can literally forget about it. Like, let me not say forget. No, your souls are intertwined now. <laughs> see, see, this, this is why you used to can't agree because you believe in soul ties and he doesn't. So you see in your soul and everything that's like, yeah, it's true because obviously you believe in that, but because he don't, you're never going to actually get to a common stance, you get it? So then why are you talking to me? <laughs> talk to the souls of the people that you do. So you know your souls are intertwined, so talk to all the souls of the people you do. You know, as a virgin, it really hurts me. It's <laughs> 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 Oh my God! <laughs> now oh. I'm done. I'm actually done. I can't believe this. Don't kill me. Anyway, we're just gonna move on to the next topic. (laughs) On to the next topic. So, guys, what do you think about using your partner's toothbrush? That's me, fam. That's fucking bad. There's nobody on this planet's toothbrush that I feel like is okay to use, fam. (laughs) Toby? That's disgusting. Nah, listen. I might change seats if you <laughs> that bad, fam. What? Do you share food as well? Oh, wait, chill, chill. I've never used my partner's seat, I'm trying to say if I would, like. Yeah. That's disgusting. There's been times, yeah, because I change my seat brush quite often, innit? Mm-hmm. And there's been times, cool, like at night when I brush my seat, I throw in my seat brush. I wake up in the morning, I'm about to brush my teeth and I can't. And obviously, I have to quickly go shop. But there was a time that I just couldn't go shop. <laughs> you just, you, 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 I don't know, I, if I'm being completely honest, like... You just used a toothbrush. I might just use a straight <laughs> Wait, so you did? No, no, I've not done it, but I'm trying to think if I would ever, ever do it. 
No, yeah, because that's okay, what... Okay, wait, wait, but don't put yourself in, like, a corner where, like, you have to do it. I'm just saying, like, would you do it just because... Oh, normally I'd never do that, like, what the fuck? No, yeah, because, for example, this is what I got from Molly May. She was brushing her... T- she, she, obviously, they both have electric toothbrushes. Her toothbrush was in a charging case. She just couldn't be bothered to go and get it, so she just used Tommy's toothbrush. And she was just like, is that weird or not? And I was just like, um, I it don't think I'd be able to no, do no. that. It, it, it's actually, no, when you actually, like, really know deeply, it's it's nasty. <laughs> especially, <laughs> I feel like especially, it's bacteria, like, yeah. like no, bro. No, that's what I'm saying, the fact that you've now well, added that not, she used... Listen, not listen, not no, listen. no, let me say something, yeah? I can't lie, that's also going to treat them, because the way people are lips and lips in each other's tongues, is that not basically the same thing? It's not even like this, it's not even like this. No, 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 no,
<laughs> Would you use share a toothbrush? Not really. No, what do you mean not really? Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it's like, it's no, Unless it's like an emergency, not really. Oh, so like the scenario I get, for example. Yeah, like if it was like an actual emergency. I, I think I've accidentally used my sister's toothbrush before. Yeah, I was going to ask that. So mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know when you ask it, when did you realise it straight away or like? No, halfway through. I was just thinking, this doesn't feel like my toothbrush. <laughs> <laughs> so the thing is that I actually hate that because I want to use, I think I want to use my margins, isn't it? And then, but you know, like obviously when you're doing it, it might like not feel that like, mad when you're yeah. just doing it. Then you notice it. As soon as you notice, you feel sick. You feel, yeah. <laughs> like, like, in, like, obviously, if I would have never knew, I probably just done it, put the toothbrush back and left in it. But mm-hmm. as soon as you find out, I felt sick to my stomach. Oh, man. Like, I know I get that scenario now, but I can never do it. Like, mm. I don't even leave my toothbrush next to other people's toothbrush. No, yeah. I can't, like, I never. Me and mom even have to put toothbrushes through it. Because I'm depending. I'm depending. Yeah, did you just say, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 me and my mother have separate toothbrushes. Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, I assume that, like, I assume that, like, oh, what? No, I meant, I mean, I, I just mean, said twice. Look, the set, look different, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm triggering your mom. I meant to me and my mom's toothbrush oh. look different, so it doesn't even matter. Anyways, <laughs> on to the next topic. Oh, this is a question. 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 Oh, this if you worked for your friend and you were in a high up position, like your job was basically patterned, I can't lie, mm. but then you got a better offer from a competitor, would you take it? <laughs> like a competitor of my friend's business? Yeah. And then they're literally. Top you, know, right you, you know, like when you said that I'm working for my friend now, yeah? Mm-hmm. Is it a case of like he really, really put me on? Like, yeah, as in like he's CEO, you're basically vice president. Like your oh. job is patterned. But you just. But what's, the, what's the pay difference? <laughs> Like it's like it's black as a steady numbers, numbers. Like, uh, uh, let's say like twenty k, twenty k difference. Yeah, <laughs> it depends though. Like, <laughs> yeah. Is it? Am I earning like forty k and now it's sixty k? Am I earning hundred and eighty k and now it's two hundred? No, okay, cool. You're earning. No, it was a twenty percent <coughs> increase, wasn't it? Oh, because... okay, twenty percent increase. Yeah, you do of the. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. Mm. I find that you said if. The scenario you gave, yeah. oh, I wouldn't do it. You wouldn't leave your friend's business. Yeah, like, if like, he's like, if he's the highest he... position, I'm second highest. Yeah. And and if you're saying he put, because when I asked like if he put me on like mm. before this, not was I struggling, but like I weren't really like. Yeah, yeah, like you were just like let's say mid in a company. I can't see. I can't. And if, then he if like this guy really your, put me on. Yeah. Then like, nah, I don't. I, what I would do, mm-hmm. and my main goal now would be to get our business to the top, rather yeah, than go into another company. You get it, like that would be my main goal. I'm loyal to my. I'm just gonna say, um, unfortunately. Like, it's not even unfortunate. So you do. This is business. That's it, nothing personal. Without your friends, you wouldn't be making money. I can't lie, yeah. Unless you're willing to give me the same pay you're getting. You're fucked. What? Why should I? Someone's offering me more money. Okay, I feel like it should be a case of unless they're trying to give you a, a pay rise, but you see that it has to now match there. Sally. No, but you need to, obviously I'm worth more than I'm getting right now, so you need to kind of, you know, entice me as well now. But you also have to know deep, yeah. It's about that, morals, like. Yeah, you, and you have to do that. Before you got to that position, you was like mid somewhere else, wherever. This, like, your, your friend now has like took you in, brought you up, maybe taught you stuff. <laughs> Like, he's already increased your pay. Loyalty. Yeah, but what like, he was getting before. Like, she didn't even say you're going to somewhere else in the same sector. She said you're going to their competitor. Yeah. That should be your competitor as well. <laughs> but now you're switching. Well, have a, I'll have a chat with my friend. You said I was chat with my fucking counsellor. <laughs> and, um, see, maybe I could even go there and just spy, maybe. <laughs> what the... Man <laughs> <say> spy. <laughs> Abra. Do you know how she's talking? You know that like, when your mom's on the phone to, like, anyone, anyone official, and she would be like, oh, yes, hello. Like, that's, that's not how you talk. Like, what are you doing, like? Could you speak code into the mic? I like your nails, by the way. Thank you very much. I do. What? It's Toby. Toby. No, Toby. I swear to God. Every time I like it, I like it. You change my life. I like it, I like it. I'm going home. No, hey, hey. Enough of that. I'm going to say, hey. Toby, you're on your last one then. After this year, you're not coming back to this podcast. This is my fucking podcast. Are you crazy, bro? So wait, are you taking the job? I have to speak to my husband about it. Oh <laughs> my lord, what the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? No, we just got here. Wait, and, and if your husband has to stay, are you staying? <laughs> yeah, maybe, yeah. Probably. 
But I have to discuss. Yeah, I have to talk to my husband about it. This girl's funny. <laughs> <laughs> no, because that's my husband just come from. Yeah. Th- th- that's that's your compadre. Well, who yeah. said that your husband then? Yeah, that, no, that, but that's that was the scenario in Desperate Housewives. Nobody says that. Okay. Nobody says that. The scenario is real life. You don't have a husband now, so why are you imagining a husband? I don't understand. Ashiki, <laughs> when you brought up the scenario, did you not say I went to Desperate Housewives? But that was outside of the podcast, and I, the, the, the people listening Thank you. will know this scenario, not the scenario that you were talking about before the podcast. But you, you said it in the podcast, that you said the, the Desperate Housewives episode. <laughs> Browsers, but it's just because they didn't know that part. That's what they mean. Like, I don't know this this for Yeah, but I'm part. speaking so tricky. Yeah. So why, why are they trying to get involved in the conversation I'm having with first you? First of all, first of all, first of all, the thing you've been receiving has been from Toby, not from me. I'm tired. No, I'm not saying you guys. No, because right now, I feel like I'm actually being attacked. As you say, every time I come on this podcast, I get attacked. Why? Did I attack? Was no, it me? that even raising that voice now. Why are they raising that voice at me? I don't know what's going on here. This is even my first encounter with you. You're already raising your waist out. I was on your side the entire time. Chill the fuck out. (laughs) Chill the fuck out. Because everything you can see today has been from him, (laughs) not from me. (laughs) That should be what's in the next one. You taking the job? No, I'm not taking the job. You're not taking the job? No, I'm not taking the job. I feel like you're taking the job. After I've discussed it with all the people I need to discuss it with, then I'll decide. As for me, I don't think I will be taking the job. And because I feel like you made a very good point. We're just going to make our company better at the fun. Yeah, no cap. Period. Anyway, okay, cool. On to the next topic. This is the would you rather. Mm. Would you rather kill your best friend and get away with it, no repercussions whatsoever, or be on house arrest for the rest of your life? You You can never leave, but people can come to visit you. The way I'm taking that question is, well, it's easy, fam. What? Would I rather my friend <laughs> live in freedom for the rest of his life yeah. or me live in freedom for the rest of my life? Hello. That's how I took it too, fam. And I've not done nothing wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. And it's like, neither Z, but like, it's unfortunate, innit? You are fake. Now, my, no, my thing is, when I say it's easy, I don't mean it's easy to do. <laughs> I mean, but, like, the one I'm doing, like, it's easy to decide which one I'm going to do. Okay, which one is that? My best friend's dead. I can't lie, <laughs> like, I can't lie. Like. Everyone is fake. Oh, wait, but pause, but pause. Everyone's fake. Wait, pause, pause. Just know, yeah, he dead, yeah. I'm, like, getting tired of you. Oh. Yeah, first of For all. For what you did. First of all. His family's good, yeah. I've got his family, no cap. So you could look at him, you could look at his family and know that you killed him. The only way I would feel bad, yeah, is if I killed him and I'm now a bomb. So it's just like, what did I do in my life? What and I just took his life away. But if I killed him and I'm successful, yeah. it's like, I did the right thing. I'm dead. Because I made up for it. Don't actually kill me. I can't lie, I'm not saying, I'm not going to finish it, impossible. impossible. What, have you man watched them prison bit? Yeah. You know, is it Terence where he was in a house like, because obviously he pretended to die or whatever, that's why the whole thing happened, innit? Oh, when yeah. he was in Spanish, so he was just in that yeah. yard, innit? And he, whatever, people came to visit him. Mm-hmm. He lived in a sad ass life, man. True. It's true. I don't know if I could do that, though. <laughs> I feel so like. You have house arrest for the rest of your life. There just needs to be motives all the time. And people just need to constantly be able to bring me stuff. <laughs> Wait, what do you say? What did you say? There seems to be murders in my house all the time. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. On That's house arrest, there's a limit to the amount of people that can come to your house. Okay, <laughs> with that rule, they need to break <laughs> off because that's know, what we're not going to do here. You know what you said, boys, all the time, yeah? I thought you say you're going to kill your best friend because if you're on house arrest, you can't go more. <laughs> no. Because you're going to be like, that is so fucked. Yeah. I'm going to ask, we did. She's talking What's about house? You can, can, can pick the house. <laughs> you can pick the house. You can be whatever house you want. Because the way I'm thinking of it is, I'm living in one fuck off mansion. Yeah, because if I was, you know, living in my dream house. Tell me what's the problem. Hey, what? What happens now? She started it. What's so what? we kept his mouth closed. Wait, no, 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 no. She wants to know the problem. No, because how can Toby be looking at me and I'm just going to say nothing? Tell me what's the issue. No, because you always need context and you need to add, like, <laughs> background to your answer. Like, you can't just be saying your answer with no context. So, wait, 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 let me ask you two questions then, yeah? <laughs> so, if you lived in your dream house, yeah? Yeah, I wouldn't mind. 
Okay, you'd kill you kill your best friend. Now, why would I kill them if I live in my? Oh, so so you'd be a house rescue. Yeah. But if it was a flat, then you're gonna kill your best friend. If it was your house right now, would you do it? Uh, yeah. You do. <laughs> so you're killing your best friend depending on what your living situation is gonna be. <laughs> Your household. Wait, so you're basically saying if you lived in like a nice mansion, you you wouldn't do it, but if you lived in a bummy place, you would do it, innit? Yeah. But you said that in your house now, you would do it. <laughs> Wait. Baby, <laughs> you're a dickhead. Baby, you're a dickhead. Baby, because you actually just tie her up your Wait. Is he, is he dead? Don't touch him. Don't touch him. Don't touch him. That's the point of this one. Andy did not say it came out of his mouth, but like. <laughs> anyway. So she said she would do it. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. No, no, no. no. G. Baby, you're weak, man. I respect it, Andrew. Me, personally, regardless, regardless of house, regardless of house, regardless you're of You're trying to violate my parents right now. And <laughs> anyway, regardless part. of living situation, me up, I'm too. I'm going to talk, talk, talk. Speak your truth, babe. Speak Here's your the truth. The thing is, yeah, Toby, do you want a problem? <laughs> when you guys are ready to continue, continue. Okay. Okay. Okay, so cool. So, what's your answer? Um, <laughs> I think if there was murder in Skyrim, all the time I'd probably take the house arrest. I just don't know if I can live with killing someone. Okay, but let's say now, because what you're now doing here yeah, is you're, adding things. Yeah, you're changing the whole rules of house yeah. arrest. <laughs> <laughs> you can't just do oh, that. Good. That's that Wait, why are you on house arrest though if you've done nothing wrong? It's just what you rather have Oh, no, because no, you're changing the, the thingy. The, the situation, but can you not change it? If you... <laughs> I feel like you guys are just choosing not to understand me. I'm not so... laughing at you. I'm laughing at the veins popping out of his head, fam. What's wrong with you? Oh, I don't want to talk to him. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, don't kill oh, me. Oh god. Don't kill me. But I love it you rather. Oh god. Would you rather you your best friend go to prison for five years for a crime that you committed, or you go to prison for two years for a crime you didn't commit? I think people are lost in prison. Wait, you go to prison for a crime he committed? Or no, no. So your best friend goes to prison for five years for a crime that you committed, or you go to prison for two years for a crime that you didn't commit? You no, know, when I commit that crime, was my best friend there? Did they commit it no. with me? No. Then why are they going to prison? Then I'm so would you rather? I mean, you're not listening. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> so sorry. The second option was uh, me go prison for two years for crime I didn't commit. Yeah, you didn't commit at all. Um, okay, let me ask you this though. You know when I'm now going prison for two years for crime I didn't commit? Did I know that the other option was <laughs> like, oh, oh, am I just? Oh, is it just life now? When no, I'm it's just life. It's just the life. It's just- these are the two options in front of you. Your best friend goes to prison for five years for a crime you committed, oh or you go to prison for two years for a crime you didn't uh, okay, commit. Okay, I'm going to pick the two years that I didn't commit. Yeah. Because why, why would I Yeah, be, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, if, you, if, about if you pick the other one, you're actually fucked. Like, what? <laughs> five like, years. Do you know how fucked that is? For a crime that you even committed. Did I tell you that I'm not fucked? Tell <laughs> 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 so you're a waste, man. No. Really? No. You're a waste, man. No. You're picking the five years, isn't it? I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm gonna go first. Yeah, I'm gonna go first, and then I'll think of my decision. Of course, I would go to prison for two years for a crime that I committed. For a crime you didn't commit? Oh, I didn't commit it. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> you didn't commit the crime, I, I, bro. I, I, That's and, the whole point. There's no, there's no reason. You haven't given a reason as to why my best friend's in trouble for it. And so. No, your best friend goes to prison for a crime. <laughs> you, yeah, this girl is not listening. I don't know how you're going to have to repeat this. You know what? I've heard the two options. And my answer... <clears throat> is I'm not spending a day in prison for some crime that I did not commit. That's, what, that's, the, that's my. I'm not saying I'm picking my friend or I'm picking. <laughs> but you are. But my no, answer, but you are. No, answer, Kobe, I'm, you I'm are. I'm spending one <laughs> goddamn second in prison for a crime I did not commit. No, because Kobe. No, no, you take that how you want to. <laughs> Whatever option you think I pick. Or whatever. Kobe. There's two options in front of you. If you don't pick one, you're picking the other. Therefore, like, <laughs> you're sending your best friend to prison. You know what you just said? Yeah, whatever you just said, no, yeah, fuck that. Just pick out of the two options right now. Five year, your your best friend in prison for five years for a crime you couldn't commit it, or you're in prison for two years for a crime you didn't commit. Which one are you picking? What's the what? 
What's the crime I committed? Let's ask you for some comment. Huh? Why, why, you see, why did he get to add ad libs? <laughs> when I was trying to add when I was trying to give more, you know, context to it, yeah. Every nigga was shouting at me. But now, if no, but now he's trying to ask more questions. No one allowed him. He said it, and then you was the first to respond. Okay, because why is he even getting the chance to say it? Because he was part of the crew that was telling me to shut up when I was trying to ask. I never sh- told you to shut up when you were asking that. I just told you to shut up in general. Oh, no, Toby, please. Tony! 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 Please, please. Nah, please. I'm gonna lie. I'm gonna lie. It's all good, bro. It's all good. Listen, Toby, we need to stop the You're actually a hater. Do you know what you do? Do you know that's what you are? If, if You're being, actually a hater. I'm being completely honest. Mm. Oh, okay. It's okay. Yeah. I'm not gonna add the ad libs. <laughs> it's just one or the other. Two years, two years, two years. You're taking the two years. That's what I'm saying, no, no. <laughs> Wait, but something you didn't commit. Did you? Yeah, so something you didn't commit. So you, so the two options in front of you are: you go to prison for two years for a crime that you didn't commit, mm-hmm. or your best friend goes to prison for five years for a crime that you did commit. Which one are you choosing? I can't. Know, that's so. That's so sad to go to jail for something you didn't do. That's the thing. But are you gonna say? But yours is two years. Hers is five, and you're the one that committed the crime. And can we all just deep for a second here? It's not you do the crime and somebody else take the fall. It's your best friend. Yeah. Like, like actually you, think they'd be sitting like, in prison yeah. because of you. Like, I actually think who does the best years. friend is. But I'll be sitting in prison because of someone else as well. <laughs> Wait. For two you years. You said, yeah, that you'd kill your best friend so you don't go on house arrest. In it. Yeah. So why wouldn't you let your friend go to jail? Why would you choose that option at night? You know just jail, you don't want to let your best friend go. Why is he talking to you? Why is he talking to you like that? Tell them to chill the fuck out now. And you, you said that you kill your friend as well, right? No, I said I'd do the house arrest. That's not good. Motives, no. No, that's not good. Motives, that's not part of the. Oh, yeah, so there's no motives. So you wouldn't do house arrest. I still do house arrest. Okay, okay, cool. I don't have the heart to kill someone, I'm so sorry. I actually don't. You say you do house arrest or not? Okay, yeah. this guy should get onto everyone's seats. No, 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 I'm not. I'm not, I'm not. <laughs> Wait, you said yes. Yeah. The I said kill. So I'm the only one who killed my best no. friend. <laughs> you think I'm gonna lie? I said me. I said kill. <laughs> Wait, so, so why are you getting onto me? We're in the same boat right now. No. Cause you both said kill our best friends. So you have to say. And we're both gonna do two years in prison. Oh, I, I can't lie. I'm not doing two years. You said two years. <laughs> he's I'm a liar. liar. He's a liar. He is a true liar. Right. That is what Toby is. I'm so sorry. He's a fucking liar. You got me. <laughs> yeah. You got me. 4K. I can't lie. Good job. Good job. So it's two years or five years. It's simple. You're nodding your head. Which one, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Which fucking one, fam? <laughs> two years or five years? Five years, yeah. <laughs> you get to, your, fr- your friend goes to prison. I'm so sorry. You're a fake. But it's the same thing that's you're happening to me, though. You're a fake. But you're only three years less, bro. Yeah, but I'm still going to prison for something I didn't do. But your best friend is going to prison for something you did. Yeah, that's something they didn't do. But you're the one that did it. <laughs> yeah, but they didn't do it. Wait, so you you allow your friend and go house arrest for your whole life, but you wouldn't go to prison for five, two years? I'm so, I wouldn't last in prison. I'm so sorry. I've heard the stories. And no, I wouldn't. I'm, I'm good. Wait, I want to know. Tell me one story you heard. <laughs> yeah, I, I just, just know we've had stories, man. No, we've had stories, we've had stories. Boy. Alright, cool, so what conclusion did you come to, really? Um, I'm going to prison for two years. I know, I hear the contradiction, yeah, mm. between my other thing, but it's just life, isn't Yeah. That's what's going on. No. I don't know. Can I say something as well, actually? With that other thing, yeah? Yeah, I picked Kill My Best Friend. But it wasn't because I want to kill him. It's because I'm not being on the... <laughs> you get it? Let's say now, yeah, if the question was, um, I do a crime, my best friend goes in for five years, mm-hmm. or I go prison for life, I'm not doing it. <laughs> the whole semester was for life, for life. Yeah. Exactly. So it's the fact that my whole life is now going to be spent inside. Mm-hmm. That's why I'm killing my best friend. Same way here now. The fact that is, I'm not in prison my whole life, yeah. it's two years, three years less than him for a crime he didn't commit anyway. Mm-hmm. It's like, I would do that. So there's a difference still. True. That means that I can't use that against you, but I can use that against her. <laughs> no, no, sure. Tell me, why is that your mate? Sure. Yes, why no. is that your mate? Because she said, you don't need to use anything against that. She <laughs> said, you're, she, already, she already admitted it. I'm never getting on to you this time, innit? You said, you, you would be on house arrest. No, she doesn't mind being on house arrest for a whole life. But you wouldn't I, go to jail for two years. You know what he explained? I don't understand. So I don't even understand what Toby's getting on to me for. No one got to you. Okay, cool. So why are you shouting? <laughs> 
I'm just gonna pretend you didn't say that. Anyway, she next? said that she wouldn't go house arrest. She was going house arrest. Okay, what's the next night. topic? Because right now Terry's really like deferring from the main subject. I mean, to get onto the topic. Anyway, me, I'll topic. see my friend when he comes out in there. That's my answer. <laughs> On to the next topic. What is that? You doing him a favor? Is that is that how you're? Gonna yeah, that, that's his repay back. <laughs> Don't yeah, say it's scum. Do it. That's a Nando's on me. Yeah. <laughs> so if you were white, would you use your white privilege? Of course. Yeah. 100%. And what for? Whatever I can. Everything, uh, everything I can. <laughs> everything. All of us are privileged, and we use our privilege in some way. So if I was white and I had white privilege, I would milk it to the extreme. Like, as much what as the I can. You would eat? I might even be a cabin just for a day. I go to. <laughs> I think I'd be a cabin as well, just to no. get the picture. Like, like, I want to know what they enjoy yeah, so much. Why? About so I'm gonna do it for one day, and all the niggas like obviously I offend. I apologize, but <laughs> for a day, fam. I don't know. We do have white privilege. I go to the pub. I'll go to like the countryside. You know. Did I tell you I can't read? Huh? No, I didn't get it. Wait, are we supposed to say stuff that we'll do that we can't do if we're black or stuff that we can still do right now? No, no. like, but like, do you know, like. Use your white privilege, Abra. Oh. Just because it's mostly white people who go pub, it don't mean it's their privilege, you know. Uh... Like, for example, I can't lie, I'd probably get like, robbed somewhere. I'd probably get away with it. Yeah. I'll do, I'll, I'll do cocaine. I'll do cat. What? <laughs> I'll do cocaine and cat. <laughs> so, what in the white privilege is going to Wait, so why wouldn't you do now? Because it's not really a black thing to do. It's not causing black people. Is that the reason you're not doing cocaine? Yeah. Before, because it's not I'm a not black thing. No, before we no. Start, I'm going like, to no. 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 yeah. take the truth with you. I'm just going to ask you, you should explain to certain people what is white privilege. Because they told me it's crazy that you're all going to start sitting down. White privilege? No! no. <laughs> If I have white like, privilege, the first thing I do is wear a hat. Like, what the fuck? Because no one's taking time to understand what you're saying. Alright, let's take time. Let's take time. No, 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 she's, 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 she's spitting though. Like, go on then. No, understand. like, okay, because okay, obviously go, go, that's not uh, that's not something we do in the black community and have been taught how bad those things are. Whereas obviously they they know something that we don't. So that's why they do it more often than we do. I hear you, but it's so, not a privilege that they do it though. They just do it more. Because it's not, it's not that there's not black people or ethnic yeah. minorities yeah, that don't do No, it's the fact that we can't do it or there's a certain, you get it, like, they just do it more, like, that's it. Okay, so why can't all our answers be just unique? Why does mine have to be wrong? <laughs> <laughs> why does my answer have to be wrong? No, you I don't have to be wrong. No, like, like, no, 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 all your answers are your opinions on what no, you... No, because no, Abena, it's, no, There's no right or wrong no, answer, because, but my no, answer Abena, always wrong. unfortunately, this time... That's the wrong answer. Every time I answer a question, I guess it's like I'm I'm getting it wrong. I'm fine. Oh, you guys are actually gonna make me fucking kill me, G. I don't know. Unfortunately, I don't want to be the one to tell you. But in this instance, that is a wrong answer. Because, uh, can I give my answer? Let me give my answer. It. My answer would be, I can't lie. Let's say if I don't do a crime or whatever. <laughs> like you fuck a crime, oh, I'm gonna slap the fuck out of a cop. I'm, I'm slapping a cop. Yeah, and Abuna, the thing is, because that's kind of why. This is what I mean again. <laughs> why are you directing this at me? Why do I need to know this specifically? It's three or other no, because, people. Because based off your answer, <coughs> it's, it's, it's not. Be, my my answer is not wrong. It's just different from <laughs> yours. Your no, answer doesn't relate to white privilege. Do you know why it's wrong? Because when you have white privilege, those are things that you can get away with because you are white. Yeah. It's not things you can yeah. do so because you're you white. You go pub. You don't go. You don't get away with going pub because you're white. You get away with going pub because you're allowed to go to the pub. You get it. Like a black person can go to a pub the same way a white person can. From now on, when you ask a question, I'm gonna Google the answer. And whatever you give yourself a right answer is, that's what I'm gonna say. Because I'm fucking sick and tired of this bullshit, man. Can't laugh. Ruby, what would you use the best thing, the best thing that I can actually think of is what you said, like just violating, violating jokes when they try to stop you. Mm. Bro, because I really want to do anything about it. 
<sighs> because that's why privilege hoes. White people stay getting away with shit. Have anyone got any final comments? Is he even talking about this show? Yeah. You see that even on TV on that when they talk about like how I'm not even trying to get into colorism on that. Mm-hmm. But when they say light skin girls, mm-hmm. also and light skin girl mixed race girls, like they shouldn't talk about being black or mm-hmm. whatever because they can't relate to a lot of the same mm-hmm. stuff. What, what do you guys think about that? It's true, is it? Yeah. But light skin. Yeah. What do you think about that? I'm gonna wait for the room to see. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, okay, so cool. This is my opinion on the light skin thing. The thing is, yeah, I feel like it's. I don't think it's fair for. Well, I don't like it when, for example, black girls on Twitter be like to be like to some mixed race girls. You can't say you're black. You can't say you're black because the thing is, they're still half black. It's not like they're fully white because at the end of the day, if we're talking about slavery times, they still would have been considered black. And they love to use the thing like, oh, you, you didn't go through the same thing we went through. No, because mm, mm, you like, see, I'm being completely honest, like me. Yeah. Me, I'm black, I'm dark skinned, I can't lie. I've never actually gone through racism in my life. Mm-hmm. You get what I mean? Mm-hmm. But then, see, this is the thing. I feel like, on <clears> top, <throat> that's another thing. It's different for boys as well. Because, oh, for right. example, with girls, it, there's a certain extent to which, for example, we can say that because there's certain things that mixed race girls are never going to experience simply because of the colour of their, just because they're lighter. For example, you see boys that are like, oh, yeah, no, nah, I just like light skinned girls. I just like, because of, because this is. How can skin color change your preference? Like, that's the problem with colorism. It's yeah, just like, yeah. what's, how has the shade got to do with nothing to do with personality? Yeah. I understand that, especially let's say like <coughs> going back to let's say, especially times in high school anyway, all times. But like, um, you know how when it comes to when you think someone's attractive, mm-hmm. boys are more vocal about who they find attractive and mm-hmm. not attractive. Like to everybody, you get mm-hmm. it. Like you be like, ah. Oh, She's then, she's then, she's then, but not all girls are really like that, you get it? Mm-hmm. So when it comes to like a black girl now, it's like, back then, guys just used to, just used to be like, fam, have you seen her lips? Yeah, her she's nose? dead, she's, like, she's she used that. to say it, fam. But like, a girl wouldn't say that because girls ain't actually vocal about how, how much they would, not to your face anyway, like, a girl would go tell her girls, oh, he's lame. Mm-hmm. But you, most of you don't want it to a guy, yeah, like, oh, yeah, I think yeah, you're lame. Yeah, like, but mm-hmm. a man will do that, you get it? Mm-hmm. So it's just like, so like, a lot of guys just be like, fam, like, look at her, this, or look at that, or like, look at, so I feel what like, What does it have to do with light skin girls being black or not? The fact that, I feel like, light skin girls don't have the exact same features as dark skin. <clears throat> and so they don't get the same treatment, like, it's the yeah. same way, for example, they have, they have, they have blackness, so they can, like, we can relate when it comes to, on a common consensus of, when a white person looks at us, we're all black, regardless of whether you're light skin, dark skin, you're all niggas at the end mm. of the day. But then when it comes to within the black community, it's a problem <coughs> where, for example, and the thing is, I don't feel like there's a problem with light skin and dark skin. I think it's when light skin people think that they, just because they're light skin, they're then above people that are of a darker complexion. And then that's when they think that they can then use their light skin privilege, which is a, unfortunately a thing, but at the same time, boys also fuel that, but that's mm. a different discussion. They could then use that lacking privilege to then think that, oh yeah, I'm better than you, I'm paying than you, da, 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 da. No, you're not. It's just because that's just the way people have fueled you to believe that you are. No, Gary, like, I don't forget what you mean, but I'm saying with that specific reason when people mm-hmm. say, because you've not been through the same stuff, mm-hmm. like, I just don't think that's warranted. Like, I don't think you can mm-hmm. say that. Because you have to remember, we all know a lot of, let me not say light skin, I don't know if you guys differentiate between mixed race and light skin, like mm-hmm. me, I do, innit? Mixed race people, we all know a lot of mixed race people. Mm-hmm. But you know, most mixed race people are probably in like predominantly white areas. Like, you know, like, yeah, do you yeah, get what yeah, I mean? Yeah. Mm. Me, oh, so you're saying the difference between, you're talking about light skinned black people? No, I, no, right now I'm talking about mixed race, innit? Okay, yeah. Like, you as a black girl growing mm-hmm. up in London, mm-hmm. where there's hella black people, white people, everything, innit? Mm-hmm. You probably haven't experienced racism like that. Mm-hmm. The lightest M- mega Markle mixed race person that's living in Colchester or Yorkshire or whatever. <laughs> They're probably calling this nigga <laughs> dusty nigga every day. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, yeah, look at how yeah. fucking quick to get to the road. Yeah, 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 yeah. She looks like fucking Queen Elizabeth. Mm-hmm. Do you get what I mean? Do you, do you, is that, let me ask that, you know. You know, so I had the track called Melanin Skin that I mm-hmm. dropped in it. So I was getting like a lot of. Um, <laughs> I was getting like a lot of um, black girls to like do a video of them, like just feeling yourself mm-hmm. like that. Like, that mm-hmm. skin's, uh, your melanin is beautiful and shit like that, mm-hmm. innit? And did this one light skinned girl who did it for me, mm-hmm. and she she told me, yeah, my son was a bit out of name or anything, but she told me that she got um, backlash from doing that video mm-hmm. in her school. Cause I think she was like 16, 17, mm-hmm. and she lives in a predominantly white area. Mm-hmm. So when she did that video, like she had like a lot of like racial abuse, even on the comments that she posted as well. Oh, uh, oh, uh, And she's, I mean, when I say this girl is light, mm-hmm. like, 
Think about it, like your normal light skin. She's lighter than that. Like she's very, very light. Mm. But to, but, but to because her, she's, she's the predominantly right. Yeah, yeah. She, she's actually a black girl. And then see, that's another thing. I feel like people also need to bear in mind is that cool to you. Yeah, you, they may not seem black, but to in the area that they live, yeah, they're yeah. the blackest person that they can yeah. be. You can't so, always compare someone to you. Yeah, but, because it's just like yeah, they may not have grown yeah, up yeah, in the same yeah. place. And it's I feel like that's yeah. the thing. A lot of people need to that like, stop jumping onto people straight away yeah. without understanding. And I feel like. Yeah. Because, like, yeah. even when this girl posted it, she posted it on TikTok, innit? But she also posted it on her, um, I, is it IGTV on mm-hmm. Instagram? Mm-hmm. And under the comments, like, there was baby who's putting question marks, like, that's where's your melanin and shit like that, like, stuff like no, that. Yeah, so I even said to her, she asked me for, out and out, she, she asked me for advice, and I said, obviously, I was saying, oh, if you want to remove it, I completely understand it. Mm-hmm. But I also said, like, stand strong with your melanin, like, mm-hmm. you know who mm-hmm. you are, innit? Mm-hmm. Like, so I was like, keep it up, but at the same time, if you feel mm-hmm. like, yeah, but yeah. yeah like when people are saying stuff in the comments, you comment like, tell bro. I can't lie, let me be harsh. Now do it, is it? Now I feel bad. Now you say it, I probably should have, innit? But I didn't think to do that. I liked it, I reposted it, everything like that. But I can't mm-hmm. lie, if I could go back in time, I definitely would have made that comment. I didn't actually think to do it, I'll be honest. But you can comment like, Oh, actually, no, maybe pause, pause. I did comment, I did. Did you actually? Yeah, I swear, because I commented on everybody who posted, because obviously it was from my track, oh, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I commented on everyone to say thank you, but mm-hmm. I still should have made a comment saying, one yeah. thing I will say though, I feel like the thing is, the only problem is with black girls, yeah, I don't think they can necessarily be blamed for that because I feel like within society, uh, especially this is a problem with black boys as well, mm. they've made black women feel a type of way where light skin girls and mixed race girls take everything from black girls. So it's like when that example purely. What do you mean? What do you mean? So it's like, for example, if that's the standard of, for example, let's just use this as an example, if that's the standard of dark skin, I mean, of, of like a black girl, anyone darker than that, the way society treats all those girls darker than that is as if, as, as if they're not beautiful. So then that then set, sets the beauty standard as mm. that's what's black. So if you're anything, you know, like the, what's that thing? The colour chart thing. Yeah, yeah. It's like if you're below that, then you can't be beautiful. And then that's the problem. I feel like that's how bl- black girls feel like, I can't lie, you can't say you're black when you're mixed race because you don't face the same things that we face where it comes to boys being like, oh, no, she's but it's look at, look at how dark she is, she's black, she's this, 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 this. But then you're still saying you're black, so it's like you can't really categorise yourself in the same category as us because you don't face the same things we do. Yeah, it's yeah. the same way, for example, even Abana and me, what, okay, that's a stretch. Abana and someone that's dark skin may not face the same discrimination that Abana and someone that's light skin may face. Yeah. So it's like they both may face the same discrimination between someone that's light skin, but then Abana and another dark skin person will still receive a whole different type of discrimination to what the light skin girl receives, if that makes sense. I hear you, you know what's crazy about that? You know when this whole thing was a topic on the TL at mm-hmm. some point, innit? Yeah. You know, I never, ever heard or knew about um, that being a thing. Mm-hmm. You know, Colorism. Yeah, I never mm-hmm. I never heard of it. So when it was on the TL, mm-hmm. I can't like stuff like sexual assault, stuff like all these sensitive topics that be on the TL, I will not tweet to say something because mm. that's when people get cancelled and you yeah, say something mad, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just go straight to my sister. Mm. I'm like, I beg you explain this to me. Mm. Like, but everything, the sexual, everything I do, I do, like, that's important because yeah, this is how people just be me. talking, talking, talking on the TL. Yeah, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, they, they talk you know. loose in it. It's like, mm. so I go straight to her, I'm like, you explain this to me. And she's my sister who brought everything down to me. Mm. Like, yeah. And I was like, what? Like, I. <laughs> Even the whole thing about how, you know, obviously, I'm not saying back in the day, but like a couple of years ago, mm. like obviously I've, I've now learned that um, that back then, like, guys used to be like, oh, a dark skinned woman, like, they would mm. cuss them out, yeah, like, yeah. the light skin. Like, I never knew about that. With me, I just always a dark skinned woman. Mm. I never knew it was even a thing. Bro. Like, my sister had It's because when you're younger, you don't really cut these kind of things. Mm. But you know, speaking about that, yeah, you know how, like, I'm not trying to compare what girls go through and what boys mm. go through, it. But you know how like cool people say there was that whole I don't know if we're gonna say it now in it yeah because I'm not sure TL is mad in it but the whole light skin phase how everyone was just loving light skin mm-hmm. but that was for both boys and girls though oh yeah it's the same thing I kind of like, we black boys did face that kind oh, of discrimination mm-hmm. it's the same way in secondary school and everyone's calling black boys blick it's yeah, the same thing yeah. it's and it's all to do with internalized hate as well mm. because of what society has made us feel listen it's all facts but. White privilege. Oh shit, yeah. Oh shit, yeah. Yeah, so we do our white privilege for many different things. Obviously, I mean, you have your own catered things, and that is completely fine. Thank you. At the end of the day, that is what you want to use your white privilege for, so you use it for that. Toby, Genesis. Wait, so if you you if you was up for a day, you'd like sniff cocaine or something? Do you sniff it? Stick yeah, yeah, I think so. I thought you were asking me as in, do I do cocaine? Oh, I no, said, no, 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 no,
But see, I'm just saying, if black people didn't really like, weren't as judgmental as they were, yeah. you do it, innit? No, and this one, so I, I also added before, that. Before you say anything, I just want to know. Yeah. <laughs> why, why are you laughing? Because, anyway. Okay, Wait, he's laughing. He's laughing. Tell me your voice. He's laughing. He's laughing. He's laughing. No. But if black people weren't as judgmental, you do it, innit? No. Why? No. Because uh, I've been taught how bad it is for your body and stuff like that. But you said to me, yeah, that if you was a white person, you would do cocaine because white people do it. And the reason you won't do it now as a black person is because it's not a black I changed my answer because I realised that was the wrong answer to give. Okay, that's so, fair enough, that's fair enough. Yeah, that's not even my answer anymore. Okay, cool. On to the next topic. It, um, okay, cool. So I saw this on um, Remy Berg's story. She asked, if you were catfished, would you forgive the person who catfished you? How lo- <laughs> See, I felt like this one, we actually have to go into it now. Because like, how long was I catfished for? Did I fall in love? Like... Let me know. A year and two months. Can I say something that she did? Actually, no, no, no. I can't believe that. 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 I can probably be cat. What if she was a, like an American babe? Like what? Do we not? We, we didn't Facetime nothing. And then she like she just she just, <laughs> fucking didn't have internet. Do is I'ma try to answer it just to not yeah. be complicated. Mm-hmm. Innit? But realistically, I can't even answer this because I can only I can, I can be catfished in a way where like oh like in a way of like let's say like I I couldn't be catfished in mm-hmm. a relationship with. Mm-hmm. I could be catfish in a way where you said you were someone I found out you wasn't. I'm like, oh, okay. okay. But like, we was never doing a thing. It was just like, you were just someone that maybe I thought mm-hmm. I had on Snap or something. You get it? Yeah. I can be catfish in that way. Mm-hmm. But if it's in a way where like, I'm talking to you and like, we're entertaining convo and that and there's a back and forth when we speak regularly. Mm-hmm. I can't be catfish like that because like, what do you mean? Like, <laughs> like what, what do you mean? Like, what do you mean? Like, the fuck? If I'm trying to make you my girl, how? Like, that don't make sense. But if you, if I don't actually care about you like that, like, you're not in my mm-hmm. life like that, I can be catfish, but we in a way where, like, by the time I find out who you actually are, I wouldn't care because you was never actually someone in my life. Like, mm-hmm. just like, you get it? Mm-hmm. But, could I forgive them? Um, maybe. Depends for the reason. If their reason really is just the fact, yeah, mm-hmm. that they're so insecure, they've yeah. got no confidence, mm-hmm. maybe they've been through shit where to tear, I'm going to forgive you. I'm not going to like you. We're not going to be <laughs> We're not going to talk after that. Like, like, don't think after this now we, we can, can be, be talking. Like, no. No, no, no. I don't, I don't hold no hate for you, but I'm mm-hmm. like, cool, innit? But, yeah. It's not like that thing. Depends for your reason. Do <laughs> <laughs> I mean... <laughs> and if you're late, I'll forgive you. I can't I'm like, like... You got to have to find, define what you mean by forgive, because <laughs> me personally... First of all, I could just never be catfish in it, yeah. But yeah. if, let's just say, it happened... I will just look at you and I'll just be like, what? And I'll probably just never look at you again. Do you get what I mean? Like, to you, that's forgiveness and all right. But like, do you get what I mean? Like, I'll, if I see you, I'll, I'll just cross the road. Like, it's not me that will ever, I'll never engage with you. Even if you come up to me now and you tell me the saddest story about why you can't trust me, like, I will just say, okay. Like, <laughs> there's, not, there's, not, there's actually nothing you can say to like, nah, I hate you. do you get what I mean? I hate you, I hate you. Unless maybe it was one emotional story and I was just like, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Even then, I don't even know. Have enough? No, I don't think so. You're not forgiving them. That's so rude. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's fucking rude. How dare you? Like, where's your manners? <laughs> where is your manners? Because how fucking dare you? How can you catfish me? And it, and then the thing is, you know what? You don't catfish yet yeah, when they don't even care. They're like, oh, yeah, I did it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I did it. <laughs> I see my girl, yeah, the whole episode, she just laughed. She, but like the way she laughed, she, she was giggling. It was just like, and she was like, I'm sorry, I can't stop laughing. Like, she kept doing that. Oh, I'm like, oh. I, the people that catfish you, you were tapped. You were actually tapped. But what do you think was going to happen? And I was like, I'm not being funny, but the people that get swindled by catfishers, you deserve it. No, I'm dead. You actually deserve yeah, it. Like, I don't know if this one is staged or not yet. Yeah. I saw one clip of, I was going to assume it was like the, the girl's sister or something. And she was with her the whole time, even when they went to travel to go and meet the catfish. <laughs> it, was, it was the cousin. It was the black, black the Yeah. They, got there, they couldn't find, like, whoever they were here to meet, innit? And then yeah. her, her sister or cousin or whatever was black. It was me this whole time, bitch. You're fucking lying. You're you fucking like yeah. lying. And she said she did it for a reason, but I forgot what the reason was. It was so dumb, though. No, like. it was like, because 
um, um, it was it was a boy. He was gay. He was being catfished by a gay. Well, the cousin was a girl. Yeah. And he and the cu- the cousin was pretending to be a guy. And it was because the cousin was rude to rude to her. Oh yeah, rude to her. Yeah, said something rude like a couple of months ago. <laughs> she called me fat. No, like so the, the guy, the, the, guy whole was, the guy was ready to marry the the catfish, like the, like engagement, like as in. <laughs> I think mean, um, even she does not have money. a job because she's bored. If you've got a nine to five, you don't have time for that. Bored because I'm so sorry. You you did the whole traveling to the different country. No, but like, you couldn't have saved us all this time and done it I'm fucking at the airport. Free flight though, free flight. That, that is so fucked. Airport food. What the? <laughs> what the? You were there. I can't lie. Those kind of people tapped. You were there planning the whole trip with me on the show, and it was you the whole time. That is fucked. You you saw the whole plan of how they were gonna catch me, yeah. and it was you. Yeah, yeah you're a dickhead. You're a waste man. I said you waited for the cameras to come out for you to tell me that mm-hmm. is fucked. Fucked. Yeah, and he cried. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'd cry too, bro. Yeah, I'm telling you want to go. I can't lie, that one there, you can never forgive your cousin alive. Fuck off, bro. Oh, they, they forgave each other that. Of course, it was American. Yeah. Of course. Because then that's a normal lifestyle over that's there, fucking like. normal, bro. What they know, you, that's weird. But um, yeah, that was a quick topic. On to the next one. <laughs> cool, so on Twitter of late there's been this whole debate of is it acceptable to take someone to a first date in a buffet? A buffet? Yeah. But that's Eat as much as you can. Like, yeah, that that's the that's that was the thing. Yeah, like it's just, and then people just so basically the girl some of the girls are like, that's what the fuck? <laughs> what the actual wait, fuck? Wait, you know what yeah? That's before, mad. Before no. you asked that, mm-hmm. That was never a thing to me. Like that's just like, huh? Like why not in it? <laughs> but like now that you see it out yeah. loud, for some reason, why does it? Why does it? Or for a first now? date. I feel no, but I'm so sorry. Why does everyone get to choose what everyone else does in their life? <laughs> it's true. actually not fair. Like that's I true. like, I like buffets yeah, that, because no, I can get whatever I no, want as much as I no. want. Like you know me, I can. <laughs> you know, I when oh. I first read it, yeah, I was like. Is it that deep? Oh, then, wait, you know wait, when Twitter starts to make you think like, is it that deep? No. So these girls, these girls would be so happy to be taken out to to get Chinese. Like, I'll get you a plate, I'll get a plate. You want, you be there snapping it, whatever. But if you go to that same restaurant, but and you're not getting a plate, you get whatever you want. It's a problem. Like, wait, I'm no, so confused. You know, <laughs> someone said, yeah, this is how he'll be in the group chat saying, bro, you know, she finished four plates, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it there. I saw it there. Oh shit! No, but did you try to watch on this whole TL thing? Yeah. Oh, I see. I see one tweet here. Yeah, what you're saying that guys taking the escalator gives me the ick here. Yeah. Let me just say something. Yeah. <laughs> the TL is so. Fu- and I see somebody reply back to it saying, "Okay, man, then from now on, just jump down, <laughs> jump down two floors, stuff like." The whole TL is just. Do- I see just one person say something. It's now a trend. It's that like, I see something someone saying about oh. Guys wearing blue pants. Yeah. And, and all of a sudden... No, it's like everyone just needs to shut up, fam, because before that... Boys wearing blue jeans, boys drinking cocktails, and oh. hanging up the ick. Bro, that's what I'm saying. Like, people just say something dumb, people <laughs> run with it, and now it's a thing. This whole buffet Bro. thing was not a thing to nobody Bro, until that first person it. made the tweet. Mm-hmm. No, but you know what you just said, yeah? I understand why I go... First of all, I think it's dumb, innit? Like, if you want to eat templates, eat templates, innit? But I understand why some girls would be like... Oh yeah, even if I'm hungry, I wouldn't want to eat all of this. Yeah, that's very rude. <laughs> for, for that question to even even be a thing, like, uh, whoever bought that to you, let me not lie. Because that's me, our young templates, bro. <laughs> 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 do, do you know why as well? Because I know I'm paying. <laughs> so I'm getting my money's worth. True. The only place I wouldn't really want to eat is a place where I have to use my hands on the first date. I'd hate that. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I can't lie, I'd hate that. I'm going to do it, but I'd hate it. I'm dead. And I'm going to try to do it with so much class, but it's never going to Yeah, gonna it's just like... This is really. Yeah. I love this conversation with my boy. He was basically saying when he goes Nando's, oh, and he's and he's with people and you get wings in it yeah. or chicken. Do you use your hands to have a chicken? No. Or like if you have corn on the cob, do you use your hands? Wait, with like, people, nah. what type of people? They have hands. <laughs> no, wait, I eat my hands regardless. No, of no, 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 when I was like in my first relationship, when I, I must be like sixteen or something. We used to always go Nando's. Like, I swear, we used to go Nando's like twice a week or something. Mm. We love Nando's in it, and every time we had chicken, I swear this like, felt good. Year and a half in it. Mm-hmm. Every time we got chicken, like half chicken, whatever, it was knife and fork in it. But it was never a thing. It was normal in it until we went one day and her friend was upset in it. Mm. So she was like, "Oh, can, can my friend come through to like Nando's mm-hmm. with us in it?" I said, "Yeah, that's fine in it." So it was me, my ex, my girl at the time, and, my, and her friend in it. And we have knife fork, and her friend must have went, "Why do you use knife and fork?" <laughs> but I swear you to know, you, I swear we looked at each other and we just like, 
I am in this deep this now. Bro, no, because <laughs> every time I've gone to Nando's, I use a knife and fork. I saw you guys eating with your knife and fork. I was thinking, every time I come to Nando's, we're all using our fingers to eat. You know what you notice? Like, her friend must have said, when you're at home, do you use knife and fork? We were both like, no, no, actually. You actually don't. When you eat chicken, you never use a knife and fork. I was like, what the fuck am I doing? What time for that? Bro. That's actually so true. I didn't actually just do that, you know. No, I never like. Even if I see everybody in the whole shop using the knife and fork, like, I will eat my chicken. How I eat my chicken? You know what I mean? Like, I've seen people. I've seen people. I don't know how it's possible. Mm-hmm. I've seen people use fork to eat corn on the cob. Like, they'll no, put the fork in. Stretching, stretching, stretching. Like, stretch, 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 like just use like, your hand. That, yeah. you just want this, that's just an inconvenience. Why? I'm, I'm here at my table with whoever I'm with. That burger. Even, even, I can't have done that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you use your there. knife and fork to eat your burger, and I what? don't know how you do that. <laughs> when this, like, because I just feel like it's so big when it's got the stick inside. Even if I was in the pocket of pineapple, like TGIs and stuff. Yeah, I would cut the burger in half no, and then eat and it then do it. But I wouldn't be the whole time. Oh, like, I, I cut it half <laughs> once. <laughs> she do that. I don't even know why I do it. It's the thing it just depends on the type of burger. Because for example, if I got a burger from a chicken shop, I'm not fucking cutting it up. I mean, who the fuck's got time for that, man? And I feel like it tastes better when it's whole. Uh-huh. Mm. Oh. oh, yeah, so then what do you then think of using um, vouchers on a first date? Oh, do you know what's bad for me, yeah? Okay, cool. I'm going to be honest, isn't it? My, my, my two answers, basically, is I wouldn't use a voucher on the first date mm-hmm. just because of how it looked. Mm-hmm. But my other thing is, like, why the fuck not, though? Like, <laughs> save your money. Like, what? I don't understand. Wait, like, what do you mean by using vouchers on cool the first So, because obviously they're talking about... I feel like I've like like spoken about this on the podcast before, but I can't remember. But I was listening to um, the receipts on, on, on one extra, and they were basically like, okay, cool, let's say you go to, I don't know, um, Benny Hanna's. No, not Benny Hanna's. I don't know, like, someone like TJ's, yeah. Then you have, like, a five-pound off voucher. And you use it. Oh, I can't lie. I'm using it from... I'm deep in it. Like, what does it look like? Because before I was saying, oh, it looks weird, but now I deep in it. No, it just looks like I'm saving money. Like, oh, now I'm going back Let again. Let me tell you something. Here. I'm not even doing it, fam. You know what? Some people need to understand. Like, in order to get a voucher, you need to be at that place for a very long time. You need to be constantly eating. For example, the, the Nando's vouchers, yeah? To mm-hmm. get that, you need to be there all the time. Nah, not really. Mm-hmm. Nah, not, not really. Because, because, because even yeah. like, okay, Nando's I know, I know, I know, I know this is less than Nando's, but like, we might know the chili stuff. Yeah. Like, you get like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think that's what she means. Like, that's what you mean about Yeah. Right? Yeah, like, you can, you can get them like. Oh, you mean. So, Where? Oh, it's the same. Sometimes thing. online, like you can. There's stuff yeah. online. And, you and can get it, them, like, but like even in newspapers, you get the whole McDonald's. You get a whole strip. I didn't know that. Though. <laughs> so like, I can't like if I've worked that hard, which I was doing to get my voucher. Why can't I use it when I get into the store and I and they say I can use it? The only thing I wouldn't do, yeah, with that, yeah, is if I had the voucher, I wouldn't pick that we're going to eat at this place because mm. I've got a voucher. But, but why not? If you pick, <laughs> no, 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 I can't. I'm not. I'm not doing that. I'm not, if you pick a Bro, place to eat date, and it happens, date, and it happens to be, I've got a voucher for that place. I'm okay, use it. wait, you guys aren't thinking smart with your money. <laughs> We're going to eat at some place and I'm going to get money off from eating there. Yeah. Why wouldn't I go there? Wait, are you picking that place because you're getting money off? Yeah. <laughs> I know I'm going to get the money off. Okay, but wait, but it's, it's the fact that you can just eat there another time anyway, though. Yeah, but I can eat anywhere another time, anyways, as well. But today it happens that I get, I have this voucher. Yeah, but yeah, 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 as a first yeah, day option, it's not like you saying. can only use that voucher today. You can use it whenever. Is that? Like, but why shouldn't I use it today? I feel like from a girl's perspective, okay. it's going to be different. Okay, why am I pretending? Okay, okay, okay. Ask you why am I pretending? Okay, can I ask you this? Really, it's never going to apply to you because you're not the one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Let me ask you this: If you're, if you were on the first date, yeah, and the man had the voucher, would do you think anything or not? No, he he thought you know we're going to this place today. You know I've got a voucher for it. Let's use it. How about if okay, I'll say nothing. Why not? I feel like the way you're talking well, is sounds no, more like a boy. Yeah, no, but there's a difference if he's using the yeah, voucher yeah, every yeah, single yeah, place no. we go. No, but if we know, you're talking about like, you're talking, talking in terms of a boyfriend. If I happen to be like, you probably come back be like, check it, you know. No, no, but of course I'll be like, of course I'll be like, oh yeah, like obviously like he's a voucher, you know. But the fact that he's got a ten pound twenty one voucher, like what the fuck? That's what you said. I'll just let a chicken know that he used the voucher. Oh, you know what you want? The voucher is no. Because that's part of the day. Just like how if you use a gift card, I'd be like, oh yeah, he used a gift card. Realistically, like, I actually don't know, but realistically, if I have a voucher, I'd probably go to that place very often. Mm-hmm. 
if I use it now on this day or if I use it next week when I go with myself, it doesn't make a difference. So This is what I, I'm saying. It, it also really... depends because if the day, if we're going to the shard for some reason and for mm-hmm. some weird reason, I've got one mad discount on the shard. Mm-hmm. I am, I promise you I'm using it. <laughs> like, no, like on my life I'm using it. Because mm-hmm. it's an expensive ass place you get. Mm-hmm. But I can't, like, if we go on, like, unless if we even go in, is Nando's on the first day a bad thing or not? I don't think, I think, I think everyone needs to chill the fuck out, you know. That's what my thing is that on the TL, yeah, people be <laughs> acting know. like people are acting bigger and richer than they are. But yeah, yeah, I don't like, think you know, I feel like the thing is, I don't know if I'd want to, uh, to eat on the first day in the first place anyway. I feel like I'd want to do something instead. But I, you know, you know, come hand in hand. It's not always like eat and an activity. I don't know if I'd want to be sitting down. The only thing, sitting down thing I'd want to do is cocktails because then I know we're getting drunk. That's it. Okay, now nah, I hear that. I hear that. <laughs> it's lit. <laughs> But yeah. Mm-hmm. How do you feel about cinnamon on the first date? Nah. Oh, we didn't get it. Stuff people didn't get it. Everyone like, put it on a pattern. Yeah, like, you're thinking it like a cinema, bro. That's what everyone used to do. Fam. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. What are you doing in cinema? That's disgusting. I don't understand. Oh, you didn't hear what she said. What did she say? What did you say? I said get fingered at the back. Oh. Is that what you are? Oh, no. We never said that. Whoa, whoa, I just said whoa. That's what everyone used to do in year eight. I'm not part of everyone. <laughs> in year eight? Bro, <laughs> same thing. I'm not part of everyone, but. That is crazy. Alright, cool. A lot of people deny it, yeah. yeah. But a lot of girls have, had, like, have done stuff in cinema. Yeah, see? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, on to the last topic of today. <laughs> if you could be reborn, would you come back as the same gender and sexuality? Yeah, because girls have it harder than life 100%. There's not even that. <laughs> Jamie, come on, 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 let me just quickly say, yeah, girls just go through bare discrimination anyway, tell them, for everything, you mean, you mean and, then, and then, and then you have your period, and then I was about to bring that, and, and then, then pregnancy, but we're talking about, we're talking about discrimination now, I understand you guys go through a lot with your whole menstrual cycle and everything, but we're talking about <laughs> pregnancy right now, <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, the whole discrimination thing, mm-hmm. do you know, just the case of like, um, the way a man will talk, oh fam, okay cool, the way men even treat women. The way a man will treat a woman, yeah, they only do it because she's a woman. The way you will speak to a woman, you're doing it because as a woman, you know she can't hurt you like that. If it was a, a nigga now, you're not going to say or do them same things, so you're going to get oh, fucked up. Oh my god, you this guy is, is, is saying exactly what Toby does to me. <laughs> because I'm a woman, this is why he treats me like this. Because he thinks I'm a smaller person, I wouldn't fuck him up. He knows that I can't fight. So he just described exactly what you are. Uncomfortable, and it's not something that you'd want to do. Mm. Can I say, you know how you said that's hard and uncomfortable? That is your normal life. Like, don't don't say it for you. It's hard and uncomfortable. Just, God forbid. Like, 
Wait, 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 like, 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 when he says normal life, it's like because every girl goes through it, being a girl that is part of it. So he's saying like, that's yeah, normal. That's like me saying, would you, what era would you want to be born in? And someone says 1700s. It'll be that, that's like Prince said, oh, that's going to be so hard. There's no TV, no phones. And they didn't have that then. And to them, that was their normal life. Okay, yeah. cool. But why would you, you want you, something bad to be your normal life? No, but it wasn't bad for yeah. them. Yes, it was. Oh, that so, was, that so was, in the 1700s, you think Edward on the road was saying, I can't believe I don't have a fucking phone that's not going to be invented in the next 700 years. <laughs> <laughs> so you think nobody had fun before that happened? Yeah, but can you not... They didn't know that they should be invented. Exactly. This is what I'm saying. What? I know the good life. Why would I choose a bad life? If there was no boys in this... Let's just say there was no boys in the world. Yeah. Then women wouldn't complain. <laughs> that's it. Because we wouldn't have nothing to compare it to. Thank you. Thank you. But if, yeah, yeah, but having something to compare it to, knowing that boys don't go through that, yeah, that's why I would say that I wouldn't want to be a boy. So the only reason that you guys talk I mean, about girl, this, sorry. the only reason you guys talk about this is because you're trying to compare it to us. But to you and all you females in the world, that is your normal life. Yeah, because we don't know anything. That is, that is the yeah, norm. Yeah, because we know better. We know that boys don't have to go through that. So if we that is your normal. I think we have it easier. For, easier. Is I don't think it's about knowing better, though. I think Thank it's just like, that is your standard. That yeah, is like, your standard. That, that, that is a, that's being yeah, a girl. Like it's part. That of is it. your life. But yeah. like yeah, but she's saying to it. If she had the choice, she wouldn't come back as a girl. Exactly because oh, I know oh, it's oh, hard. Oh, oh, I, I get yeah, that. Yeah, I'm yeah, just yeah, saying. Don't yeah. be saying how oh, it's so hard to be a girl. Like that is your life. That is your normal life. But yeah, wait, but I wouldn't choose that. Exactly. Oh, calm, calm, calm. Yeah, that's that's her point. Yeah, yeah. No, because because what you just added now, mm. the whole debate didn't start off with just that. Like I get yeah, why yeah, you wouldn't yeah. want to be a yeah, why yeah, you yeah, wouldn't yeah, be a that, boy, yeah, yeah. but yeah. I'm just like obviously because of that. And also another thing you need to remember, you know, periods actually vary for every girl. Like yeah. some girls don't feel shit. A lot of girls yeah, yeah, don't yeah. have don't feel. It. I swear, I swear, a lot of girls only like have like go have their paper like let's say two three days. I also feel like a lot of girls that complain about periods. Probably don't actually need to be complaining. It's like, I remember one time, no, no, what, what I'm about to say. It, don't tap me, man. I'm not involved in this one, bro. Uh, it, like, a lot of girls. Toby, you're just proving to me once again what everyday men are, man. Go on. Uh, Continue if you must. Let me say, I'm not talking about the majority of girls, it's probably minority, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But you think a lot of girls don't like, especially when they're talking to a boy, like, they don't exaggerate their periods, like. No. They'll be like, oh, come take care of me, like, oh, it's all the pain, like. Uh, <laughs> No oh, wait. But before the boy, you was doing everything for yourself. Like, you was in your period, and you was hiking to Nigeria. Nobody was helping you. But now the boy's there, oh, I'm in my period. Oh, my God, please come take care of me. Like, oh, oh, but maybe there was just nobody else to say it to. Yeah, exactly. It doesn't okay, mean... Okay, how, how are you doing yourself? Though? Okay, wait, wait. If you're in the room by yourself, yeah? Okay, cool. The same now, yeah? Let's say if I fall to the ground, and, and it's hot, and I can't get up. If I'm by myself, I'm not asking the, the walls to help me. But if someone's in the room, I'm like, can you help me? No. They'll be like, oh, I can't even do it. Would you say you can't do it? I need you to help me, or would you just say it's gonna be it's gonna be a bit difficult? I might have to push through it, but there is that just long though. But yeah, well, um, do you not have love in your heart? I might have to think about the question, fam. Because I don't understand why he's upset that someone's asking him for help. Oh, nobody asked me for help. What are you talking about? Like, um. <laughs> We're having a general conversation. I'm just no, but up. wait, Toby. The thing is, yeah, you're basically trying to say uh, why girls over exaggerate. But the thing is, as Prince said, sometimes there's just no one to say it to you. Now I'm saying it to you. If you don't like it, then you just tell me to shut up. Oh wait, let me also add, yeah. You know how like you said the whole thing about girls being like, oh, come on, let's tell you, she didn't exaggerate. Also, you have to remember that when girls are on the period, they're a lot more sensitive anyway. You get it. So like, when it comes to like, the I whole like, I like him. You need to learn more from him. Mm-hmm. Because he knows how to okay. spit some facts. You can like him, okay? Yeah, wait, 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 but, but like, you, you have to go like, they're, they're sensitive and emotional and stuff like that. So they want a lot of love and affection, especially when uh, the it's same. Like, I'm so sorry. No, boy, wait, boys go through a lot of processes where they're testosterone. Okay, okay, cool. Your testosterone. Their so testosterone sorry. levels increase and decrease. I'm so sorry. Like, we are emotional. Bro, 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 and the problem is, girls are still empathetic to the fact that you're emotional. The most that they'll say is, ah, oh, you're on your male period. Okay, but we're still empathetic to that fact. You lot, yeah, act like as if periods are basically like, oh my God, why, why, why you cry, why you cry, why you cry? Until, do you know what that is? You're shedding a whole layer of your uterus, yeah? Listen, hmm. let's not talk about it. Let's actually not talk about it today. Because if I start screaming, have you seen all the effects of pregnancy on oh, TikTok? Well, do, do it. It's the same way. You know how, like, when a girl's on a period, yeah? 
And like, I guess I'm bringing to the old fake anyway, but continue, continue. So you know how like a lot of more. Whoa! Whoa! You know how whoa! Serious whoa! Whoa! Prince! Prince! Uh, <laughs> no, you're not gonna say what you're saying. You're not gonna say what you're saying. I don't know what you're saying. Say it again if you're bad. Alright, one of the effects of pregnancy. Say it again if you're bad. A lot of the effects of pregnancy I've been seeing. Like, I saw something about apparently all your teeth fall out. Huh? Yeah. No, yes. that's that that true. Yeah, it can happen to some women. Fall out. Do you know anyone that their teeth? My mom's what's it called? My mom's teeth fell out. She, her teeth decayed when she was pregnant. So now she has no teeth. She didn't have no teeth, but some of her teeth did fall out because of those are some of her symptoms. Really? Yes. Why she lied? So <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait, I'm gonna make my mom lose and teeth. Thing, and this is the thing. the point. Why do you never want to believe girls? Exactly. You know, cap, what's the point of cap? We're not you people. Now let me tell you why I didn't think that was correct. <laughs> <laughs> I saw, I saw a tweet about it. I went through the comments and the quote tweets and everything said, this doesn't happen. Okay. And this is why people need to stop just talking on Twitter anyhow, anyhow. I lie. I lie. And now that you guys have said this, said this, you have made your point, you have even referenced your mother. I have now been educated. Thank you. I feel like you got to where they just told me. How many, how many of your mom's teeth came up? I don't know, but she was. She said that was the worst pain of her life. So even now, I, that, she I has that some missing teeth in it. Yeah, but yeah, and she. I think she has some black teeth as well. She, her teeth were just dying. That's crazy. See, I never knew See? that. Either. See, but the difference with me, I never knew that. But I won't now argue with it. As soon as you tell me, it's like. But this guy here. I said that you told me. I don't know. I don't know if he wants yeah, to hate women. My wrongs. You hate women. I have knowledge my wrongs. Well. You hate women. Oh, I hate what? You hate women. You are not all women. So what, what are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about? Wait, wait, wait. Actually, I'm not saying. I lie. I lie. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not saying that. What I meant to say, what I meant to say. I'm not thinking it through the you're not, <laughs> you're not a woman. So just because I've said something here and you think, oh. Anyway, let's leave that in there. Anyways, if I was reborn, I'm coming back as a boy. Life just seems a lot simpler. I'm coming out as a white male. White, white, white. Oh, black like, I'm, I'm coming back because I'm black male still. But you said sexuality as well, so like, would any of you not be straight if you were to come back? I might be bi. Oh, actually, I might be a bi girl. Mm. Oh, no, I want to be a bi Wait, boy. you come back as a girl, but bi. You, you come back as a girl, but bi. Uh, not as a boy, but bi. You, you, I feel like being a boy, but bi is wrong, though. I feel like because no one ever takes you seriously when you're a boy. But so you'd be no, a girl, but, but like, bi. I'd, I'd be yeah, like, if you see it. Right I'll so be an American bi boy. Because can you choose being bi? Are you fucking alright? See, that's another topic, if you ask me. We're not going to write it. Oh, <laughs> right, cool, cool, so, you believe that people are born like bisexual, people are born gay, people are born like. Yeah, I don't think it's a choice. Mm. Okay. Well, wait, so you think from birth? Yeah. Abena, what would you come back as? I'd come back. <laughs> yeah, you can't go into that, uh, but you uh, can't. Oh, a a bi American boy. Gender and sexuality. Yeah, bi American boy. <laughs> Nah, I made the fact she stayed on that answer though. Oh, I made that stuff. Wait, can I please say something? You said you come back as a white man. Realistically, are you actually going to be a white man? Like, Probably not. I feel like being white. Yeah. You know what? Ooh. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait, sorry, being white, what? <laughs> no, I'm chilling. <laughs> being white. No, 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 because you were about to say something there. It's an interesting you know concept. what? He talks like you don't have the power to even bleep shit. Like, he's, he's come with a lot of vim, yeah, but you can really bleep uh, and take it out. If you wanted to, because you don't edit the podcast for her. You know what? Do you say that she can bleep it? Hmm? Yeah, she can bleep it. Yeah. So isn't that more reason for her to say a fucking answer? Or no, right so then no, because you're trying to push it. But if she doesn't want to do it, she doesn't have to. You're talking a lot right now. I'm talking to her. I wasn't actually talking. <laughs> and I, I was talking to her chick originally as well. But you interrupted. Then you interrupted me. Ignore him. Ignore him. So no, but did he not interrupt my conversation? Don't give him the energy. Don't give him the energy. I hear you. Don't give him the energy. It's cool. You interrupted your conversation. You speaking to. The, the, the so that, that is, what's the next topic, Coasters with the most is? <laughs> this better not be the last time you call me here, by the way. <laughs> the last topic, <laughs> Anyway, guys, we've come to the end of the episode. That was a lot that has gone on today. I'm hot, I'm stressed, <laughs> and it's just been mad. Oh, Make sure you follow the Let Me Learn podcast on Instagram and Let Me Learn podcast for our Let Me Learn pod. Use the hashtag Let Me Learn pod. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Guys, Basically, what has happened now is if you want visuals, we now have a cash app. So if you're feeling generous, cash you can follow the me. link. Cash at me. <laughs> I'm joking. Cash at Let Me Land Podcast. And it's in the link tree thing, whatever. Anyone got anything they want to plug? Um, I do music. Prince, tell them, tell them, tell them. Um, YouTube and that. 
Prince mm-hmm. G official. Mm-hmm. Um, subscribe to that. I beg. I beg. Mm-hmm. I beg. Um, just dropped a new track back two days ago, King King and Freestyle. Mm-hmm. So obviously check that out and yeah, more to come. Toby. See that hair part on Insta. See that hair part on Insta. Nothing though. <laughs> just plug good vibes. Yes. Good energy. Yes. Many things in life and temporary, but enjoyment is forever. Amen. Everyone say bye. 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 Toby, you're going to say bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>